afternoon, DC. I'm Brooklyn. And I'm Chase. And today is Tuesday, September 4th, and here's the news. Campaigning for class officers, president, vice president, secretary, treasurer, and reporter for the school year 2018 to 2019 are through September 7th, and elections are Friday, September 7th. Attention students, if you are interested in going on a trip to London, Paris, and Normandy during spring break of 2020, there will be an informational meeting on September 6th in room 213 at 8 o'clock after open house. This meeting will be your opportunity to learn about the trip, ask questions, and learn how to register. Parents and other guardians are also welcome to attend. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Isler in room 213. Congratulations to 25 of our own talented DCHS students who have entered 46 different art pieces in the high school division of Three Hearts of Arts Art Festival. The artworks are currently on display at the Town Square Mall across from the Christopher Banks store. The actual festival will be held Saturday, September 15th from 12 to 5 p.m. There will be exhibits by regional artists, artist demonstrations, and live music by the blues band Beyond Blue. It should be a very fun and entertaining day. We hope to see you there. Here are some of the artists. Now stay tuned for Powers Points. Hey DC family, hope everybody had a great weekend and uh, ready to start the week uh, on a positive note. Um, got a quick little quote for you today. It says, yesterday ended last night. And uh, when I hear that, I think of, um, you know, you might have had some things happen to you in the past, something negative might have happened uh, to you. Don't let that define you. That's in the past, that doesn't have to be your future. Uh, by the same token, you can't live off past successes either. Just because you were successful at something in the past doesn't mean that that's always going to be that way for your future. So you have to continue to grow. Uh, so what are some things you're going to do today to get better as a person, both mentally, physically, emotionally, socially? Those are four areas that you need to grow in every day uh, so you can become a better person and be successful and help others be successful. So I've uh, got a couple shout outs. This first one comes from Miss Nicodemus uh, to Mason Boswell. Uh, Mason helped clean up uh, after the county to college when all of his teammates were coming in and getting free pizza. He decided to uh, spend some time to help the adults clean up. And Mason, I appreciate that. And I know the, uh, that Miss Nicodemus and all the guidance department appreciates um, you thinking of others before you got your food. So next shout out goes to uh, Devron Mason. This comes from Mr. Thompson. Um, said a student fell and knocked over two desks and Devron quickly got up to help the, the classmate and uh, help them up and helped uh, get them off the ground and, and help get the room cleaned up. So Devron, thank you for that. Um, appreciate you guys and all that you do and hope that you have a great day today and a great week. And as always, stay classy DC. 
Emerge Next program for freshmen at the Wendell H. Ford Government Education Center. We will be having another round of open enrollment for students who would like to be a part of the 2018-2019 Emerge Next class. This program is only for freshmen high school students and there is no monetary fee required to be a part of the Emerge Next program. Students may apply online at FordGovCenter.com under the Apply Now tab and choose the Emerge Next application. The deadline to submit the completed application is Friday, September 7th. This Thursday at Open House, we will be doing the following. From 5 p.m. to 6 p.m., there will be a picnic dinner in the cafe. At 5.30 p.m., there will be a junior parent meeting in the auditorium. And from 5.30 p.m. to 8 p.m., parents are able to visit the classrooms on an individual basis. There will not be a bell rotation as there was in the past years. Pause will have spirit wear for purchase and order in the lobby. The following ACT review sessions will be offered next week from the English department. Wednesday, September 5th, English review in room 134 from 7.30 to 8. Reading review in room 134 from 3.30 to 4.30 that afternoon. Friday, September 7th, English review in room 134 from 7.30 to 8. Reading review in room 134 from 3.30 to 4.30 that afternoon. Campaigning for Freshman Student Council representatives is through September 7th. Elections are Friday, September 7th. Freshmen, this is your chance to make your voice heard on any issues here at DCHS. Any questions, see Mr. Crop. Those students interested in joining Beta Club need to pick up an application from Ms. Therese Payne in room 137. Applications are due by this Friday. Old members do not need to reapply. Here's what's going on today at DC. There will be an ACT prep science review session at 3.30 p.m. in room 204. Boys golf will be taking on Catholic at 4 p.m. at Ben Hall's Park. Girls golf will be taking on Catholic and Muellerbrook County at 4 o'clock p.m. at Ben Hall's. Our girls soccer team will be taking on Owensboro starting with JV at 5.30 and varsity at 7 p.m. Our volleyball teams will be traveling to take on Apollo starting with freshmen at 5.30, JV at 6.30, and varsity at 7.30. Stay, Stay classy, DC. DC.